Hi and welcome back to another tutorial. Um, today I will show you how you can FA coat your bike. It's another type of uh, coating you can do. And how to report any changes from the previous coating. If you mess up something or you want to go to the default settings of your bike, it's a very using way using this FA coating and let's start well, I will not connect to my bike you probably will see something um, different but uh, you will go to the bike connect as I showed in the previous video and from that um, I, I will show in the video I will have to load some files just to uh, emulate that I'm connected to the bike there is no um, uh, no big difference here so after I started the uh, uh, Beamer utility also the is 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 started I have to go to export mode and then coding and I will hit read uh, my data it's already loaded so here we have the FA what the FA is from my understanding I'm not an expert it's a list with all the options that your bike uh, came so, for example, here you will find everything, even what seat you have. For example, if you have the M seat, it will be here. Um, from the software part of, um, of you, this is not very important, but here you will have, for example, in my car, I also have a BMW, I have leather seats, and I have an option here, a code, one of these. Um, that tells uh, that my car came with leather seats so uh, every option here is not uh, completely software dependent it also you will find something that it doesn't really matter from uh, coding part of you um, okay so let's start uh, first of all you will go to read VA um, I'm not connected. Uh, after that, the EA will be red, and uh, from here you will go to um, expand all of this, and you will search for this this thing here. Um, here you can add some options. Um, I believe that uh, you can also use the Beamer tool, and the Beamer tool should uh, um, open you something like that if not go to save you will save this thing this uh, this file uh, the file I mean, override uh, I will go with uh, yes and I think now I can also go to Um, and here I can load that, that file and I can check some options as you can see in the left part I have the options that are uh, already installed as I said M Sport Seat, Riders Manual, German this doesn't uh, really matters for us but what matters I don't know Driving Modes Pro, uh, Dynamic Package, DTC uh, Dynamic Damping Control. I think that you can uncheck this, and if you uncheck this, um, you will uh, now uh, won't get an error if you remove your um, damping, uh, the stop damping, the electronic damping control. Um, I will put it back. Uh, and now I will show you the most uh, as thing uh, daytime driving lights uh, as you can see I already have it here so you will search it uh, let me uncheck it okay. time running right and it will go here from here you will go to save you have changed change it that's okay what else you can do if you don't want to use the beamer tool and 
for example you know the code that you want to add here you will go um, on edit um, I have already have changed it I will load it again edit and now expand go here and for example add the option 202 uh, which means they find running lights for example like this I will remove it save it and I will edit again don't forget about the comma after every option here you must have a comma as you can see without spaces or anything save it save it up here again and then we will proceed to write that on on the bike um, go to export mode pcm here at the vehicle order you will load the file that you worked on um, and here uh, let me check oh you have to go first before um, the option write FA um, right click calculate FA and now you can write it on the vehicle um, after you write the this on your vehicle um, pop-up dialog will show loading you write it on your vehicle you are going now back to coding um, I will click no because I'm not connected to the bike and here for option 202 you will have to recode the module that uh, are supposed are the, the new vehicle uh, order will make changes to um, not every change will make you, you make in the vehicle order will change all or, or, or the modules so for example here the change that will be uh, made it's in the XBCO and uh, in the X compi but uh, what what you will have to do in order to have the uh, daytime running lights We'll have to right click this module code and then go to the other one and click code after the, the first one is finished. What does um, what this does? Um, basically it's it reads your all, all all of your options that you have installed on uh, on the bike now with the new option added 202 and the module with code is set to the default value. So that means if you have you had made some changes in the previous um, in the in the um, with the previous video in XCOM B3. Uh, this means that they will return to default value, but with the new option that you added in the uh, vehicle order. So default value, but they will keep also the uh, daytime running lights. If you completely want to go to the stock version you have to save all your options as they are now on your bike and load the saved vehicle order the original vehicle order and you want to go to code every each module and they will go to default values just click right click and code each module and they will go to the factory setting Hope that uh, this video helps you let me know in the comments if you want what do you want to see next and i will do a tutorial for that um, let me know if you succeed with this one and if you want me to connect on the bike to do this live if you encounter some problems